Now, I don't know about you, but I love when things move quickly in my life. I love speed. And what I mean by that is that feeling you get when you just get yourself out of the way and you tap into this state of flow where your mind just relaxes and you become ultra productive and clear and purposeful. Don't you wanna be in there more often? I mean, we all do. And I really believe it's one of the reasons why we're here as human beings is to explore these kind of higher dimensions of awareness where we tap into these greater states of flow and our normal constraints, our normal limitations just melt away. Now, of course, everybody's question is, how do I get there? How do I do that? I wanna give you one tip today. Uh, I basically use my life as kind of a laboratory for testing these things out. And I only share what I think works extremely well and it's very practical. So what I'm about to share is very deep, it's very profound and it can have very profound ramifications for your life but at the same time it's very simple uh, and that's what I love about it, the simplicity. So here's what I believe to be true about this. The reason people don't tap into this state of flow more frequently is that they are stuck in a process of resisting change in their life. And to get into that state of flow, you have to be willing to embrace change. There's a direct correlation between the two that I really want you to start playing with. So the reason we resist change is because we're mainly afraid of it. We, we try to preserve kind of what is known, the status quo, because that's what we're taught to do in this life. That's what keeps us safe. So unfortunately, most of us have kind of bought into a BS story about change. We've been taught that it's really hard, it's something to be afraid of, it takes a really long time, and especially the big changes, the meaningful ones, like losing that extra weight, making more money, falling in love, the things that are the most meaningful to us. So what I want you to do is first become aware of your relationship with change. What story do you tell about change? Is it really serving you? Most likely you'll find that there's some work to be done there. And what I want you to do for five minutes a day for the next 30 days is write down a new story about change. And in particular, I want you to detail how from this point forward, change in your life is something that you love. It's something that excites you. It's something that brings you to life. And, it, and it's something that's easy for you. It doesn't take long. It's something that you can actually create instantaneously and a lot of the time. And that's actually true. Once you start experimenting with it, you see just how there, there's just this collective myth that change has to be hard. I guarantee you the more you do this, the more you practice seeing change as an easy process, the more you'll naturally fall into this state of flow, your productivity will soar, your confidence will skyrocket, and you'll be able to create things in your life with so much more efficiency and ease than most people do. So please stop telling yourself the story that it's so much um, easier said than done or that it's gonna take me five years to do this or that. Uh, or so-and-so can do it, but there's no way I can do it. It's all in your mind. It's all a belief that you can knock out right now. Make sure that your beliefs serve you in regards to change. So do this for 30 days. Report back to me. Leave a comment underneath this video and let me know how it goes. Uh, and this is one of the just those simple gems that has been a total game changer in my life uh, that has allowed me to just more rapidly create what I want uh, and really get more intimate with this process of like manifestation and, and intentionally designing my life. So embrace change. See if that surrenders you, gets you naturally tapped into this state of flow. Uh, and I'll leave it at that, you guys. Uh, I also just recently came out with a book called The Instant Upgrade. I'm gonna leave a link for that in the description below. It's all about this. It's really about how to tap into higher frequencies of reality so that you can reclaim your infinite power as a human being and really live life on your terms. So check out the link below uh, and I hope it helps you out. Uh, my name is Kevin Doherty and I really uh, look forward to connecting with you. Please uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel and I will talk to you soon. All the best.